Clock running with 6.44 remaining opening quarter. No score. Good drive here by the Falcons. Both teams have one fumble so far. Here comes some pressure. A lot of pressure, a lot of pressure, and we got him. That's a good job there by number 12, Sanchez. Sanchez was blocked, Bob, and he still reached his hands out, and, and Taylor Cornelius uh, took just a little too much time there, and he was tackled for a loss. He's going to lose, what, about from uh, eight yards on the play, so a minus eight on that play. That's fourth down. Ten yards on the play, Bob says, was lost on that sack by Sanchez. And the Mules have the ball back here with no score and a six-and-a-half minute. Or six-and-a-half minutes to play here in the first quarter. And it's a Mules ball on their own 34-yard line. Baca takes a pitch over on the right side, has some running room. He'll have a first down and a couple more as he's run out of bounds on the 47-yard line. Good pitch there on the option to the right side. 12 yards picked up by Baca. And it is a first down, the second of the night for the Mules. The Falcons have four first downs so far. No score in the ball game. 6.24 remaining. Clock stopped as we had to go out of bounds on that play. First and 10 for the Mules on their own 47. There's a handoff. Good cut there by Baca. And he'll have about eight more. It looked like he would be tackled for maybe a two-yard gain. And he made a cut, Bob, and picked up six more yards. Let's see where they place it. And it is, a, it is an eight-yard pickup for Junior Baca. Second and two now for the Mules. And they go into Bushland territory for the second time tonight. The first time was after a fumble, and they fumbled the ball back to Bushland. So they're in uh, Bushland territory. Another first down, number three for the Mules of the night. Looking, there's a pass. Whoa, man, Bob, that could have been intercepted twice there. Had a man out there, and we overthrew him, and it went through two Bushland players' hands in, so it'll be third down and two for the Mules. Very lucky there, and if they catch it, they have an open field, too. Pass just a little bit high. We'll probably run it here on third down to try to pick up the first down. That's Regalado in, number 42 for the Mules, and running back now. And he takes the handoff and bulls his way to the first down. Picked up three on the play, Bob. And that should be a first down for the Mules. Number four of the night, number three on this drive. So the Mules are moving the ball again. And it's on the 43-yard line now in Falcon territory as we set up with uh, slot men on both sides. Regalado takes a pitch, has some running room. He's loose, Bob. He's loose. He may go down across the 10, the 5. He's gone. And that is not uh, – that was Junior Baca is who that was in. Junior in there. And Junior goes uh, 42, 43 yards. And that was a pitch again on the left side. So far, that play has been good to us tonight. And Junior just found a lot of open space, and they weren't going to catch him. We had Regalado in for one play, and then Junior back in, and he goes 43 yards for the touchdown, and the Mules score first. They lead 6-0, and they'll try for the point after. And this year has 74 yards. 74 yards so far tonight on five carries for Junior Baca. Elizalde, the kicker, and it looks good. Let's see. It is good. So Elizalde continues to kick the ball well. The Mules lead 7-0. And they will kick off, and Bushland did move the ball well the last series, and we'll see what adjustments the Mule Chew defense makes. We'll be back with the kickoff. So it's first and 10 to go for the Falcons as they're threatening for the second time tonight. The Mules did hold down in this area a few moments ago. There's a long pass. They have a man down there. It's, is it caught? Incomplete. They, uh, a little pushing going on both ways there, nothing called. And uh, our, it looked like our defensive back fell down then, and it looked like they could catch the ball for a touchdown, and they just didn't catch it then. So second and ten. Pass intended was marked in pencil. All right, so on the 27-yard line of the Mules, it'll be second and ten, 341, clock stop, first quarter. 27. That's a fourth time they've tried that uh, – Long pass over in the corner. We've been lucky so far and batted down a couple of them. There's a little swing pass out there. It's caught, and it's going to be good yardage there as we tackle Bushland out around the 
You know, 22 or 3 yard line looks like. Pick up of 6 on the play, so it's third down and 4. So a 2, uh, 4 down uh, area here for the Falcons as they can go for it on all the 4 downs. If they don't make it on third, it's third and 4. Watch for the big quarterback rolling out and keeping the ball here, Bob. Now he's back to pass, fires, has a man wide open, good pass, and it's a first down, and they're down to about the six-yard line on that play. Get the tackle. All right, Smith is a receiver, and uh, so that's uh, all the way down to the six-yard line, another first down for the Falcons, and and, uh, boy, he just raffled that ball in there, and they were open, Bob. Moving the ball. The Falcons are trying to tie this one up or go ahead by one. 16 yards on that last pass play. 250 remaining opening quarter. Taylor Cornelius in the backfield. Has a time. Fires, and it's incomplete over to the side. Number 40, a little swing pass. Couldn't hang on to it. So it's second down, and... Goal from the six. <laughs> and you might look for Cornelius, Bob, to roll out to the right side and just run with it because he has been open on that play. So second goal from the six-yard line for the Bushland Falcons. Mules up 7-0. Back to pass. Pressure. Pressure, pressure, and he throws it into the end zone, and it's incomplete. That one was up for grabs, and no one grabbed it. So it's third down from the six, goal to go. Had, uh, had pressure on Cornelius in. He just wouldn't go down. He threw that ball with a couple of guys hanging on to him, and that was one that anyone could have caught, but no one did. So it's third down and goal from the six for the Falcons. 2.32, clock stop, first quarter. Nice night for football. Both teams have played well on offense, and the Mules have had one big defensive stop, and we'll see if they can get another one here. Third down, two backs in the backfield. There is a handoff, and the Mules then rise to the occasion, and they tackle a runner for no gain. That was, uh, that was Cannon carrying the ball, number 74 on the tackle. That's David Gonzalez, and he had the help from a couple of other players. And it's fourth down, and it, are they going for a field goal here, Bob? Lose yard. Yeah. yeah, and they're going for a field goal here. Torres will be the kicker on this. They'll try to cut the gap to 7-3. Love is holding the ball for the Falcons. And here's a kick. It looks good, and it is good. So it's 7-3 now. The Mules lead by four as a good drive of the Falcons ends in a about a, what, 18-yard field goal. And it's 7-3. to three. Mules you with 149 remaining here in this opening quarter. Cornelius, like I said, is big, tall quarterback, 6'3", 170, and a junior. As we mentioned earlier, they have a really junior-laden team. And Cannon is a running back. Now a quarterback came straight back. They may want to run the screen this time. Now he's going to throw it. And it's intercepted. Intercepted by, let's see, it may be Ryan Johnson. He may go. He may go all the way if they don't catch him. And he is going to go all the way. That'll stop that. And that's uh, 83 yards. Ryan Johnson. Center and <laughs> tackle. So, Ronnie, that that was big right there because the Falcons have really been moving the ball on us. So, let's get that. 80, 83 yards on the interception from Ryan Johnson. And uh, Elizalde. Will be kicking the extra point. The holder will be Ross. Look like, uh, let me see it. Look like Bob. We were about to clip on that uh, return, and uh, it was clean. What we did, we slowed up and 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 got in front of the would-be tackler. So it was a clean block. It was Junior. Good job, of Junior. The Mules lead 13 to three on that big 83-yard interception by Ryan Johnson for a touchdown. 
as Bushland was, they were really moving the ball. Holder is Ross. The kicker is Elizalde. There's a kick. Looks good. And it is good. 14 to, 14 to 3 for the Mules. The Mules have zero passing tonight. They had one completion that was uh, rubbed out by a penalty. Now we have twins to both sides. One running back. And I assume that is. Uh, 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 kept it and. Picked up two or three. David David Riley on the tackle. We had some run, uh, running room there, but the one guy Riley stopped. Second seven. So it's going to be second seven. Uh, they've uh, they defensed have us defensed uh, probably better than anyone this year. Yeah, he throws it. Caught. Okay, good catch there. And let's see who caught that, Ronnie. 81. That went from the 29, 29 to about the 47. And Ronnie. 18 yards. And that was 81. 81 is Matthew Barone. And a first down. And they'll have it on their own 47. Let's try not to get a penalty. Yeah. Well, they, they had the pitch covered and auction. Then. They did, tried to get it to Regalada then, and we lost some then. Lost three, lost four, lost uh, four. They did a good job on the option then. I tell you what, Bob, and they came, came close to batting that down for a fumble. Okay, second and 13. Lost three. And now twins to both sides. Regalado in the backfield. Handy to Regalado. And no gain. That's the best day of defense uh, that uh, we've seen Regalado defense this year. Defensive lines uh, whipping us at the moment. And they're, uh, they have some really tough players in there on defense. So it's a passing situation for... Woods and empty backfield. Three over to the right, two receivers to the left. Third and 13. Straight back. Now in there to number 21, Martinez. And Martinez still running. And he has the first down about the 30. Seven. Okay, uh, Ronnie. He went. He went from his own forty-five. To, okay, that's five, fifteen, twenty, uh, about uh, about uh, eighteen yards, and a first and ten. Good run there after the catch. And that was uh, Martinez. So big, big play there on third down, third and long, and w Woods keeps it. Has a first down. Uh, I think he has a first down. Ronnie went from the 37. 25, uh, I think it's going to be about the 26. 11 yards and another first down. 46 yards on four carries for Wood. Okay, we have twins to the uh, both sides. And the running back is... Uh, 42, Regalado, I believe. He and uh, Junior are switching off. No, oh, that's Junior. Starts outside, gets a good block. Oh, good, ta good tackle over there. And a good tough run there by Baca, but good tackling also by the Falcons. They picked up six. I guess he didn't. His knee didn't hit the ground. Apparently it didn't. That's a nine, uh, 80 yards on uh, seven carries for Junior. 80 yards on seven carries for Junior Baca. Second and four. Thank you. Yeah, it's complete over there. He may score. And. That is a touchdown. Ronnie, who was that to? No, let's get the number. Uh, we're trying to get the number over there. Right here, right Chris Lozano. Here. You sure it's Lozano? Yeah. That's what, right there. Well, that's what they said up there. It's not the right one. I'm like, right. Ten. 
Austin Ross. Austin Ross, 14. Austin Ross, 14. And it was 20 yards. And the kicker is Elizalde. The holder's Ross. It's it up. And he barely got it over. <laughs> it, 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 it was deflected. So it's 21 to 3 with 602 remaining in the first half, and we'll be right back. And here come the mules, and and uh, going to run with it. He's going to run for another first. No, he's going to pass it this time, and that's going to be oh intercepted by the mules. Oh man, that was uh, Martinez. Bob, let me tell you about that play. We had uh, things were on our side then. All all Carnelius has to do is run for another first down. We have no one out there again, Bob. He's going to run for first down, and he threw it right to Martinez. Martinez batted it in the air, made a, did a good job of intercepting. So they were on the move then, and the Mules come up with a big interception. That's the second interception for the Mules. Both teams have had two interceptions tonight. Of course, they, caught, they intercepted one down in the end zone just before the half, so I guess that evened out on that play. Good job by Ray Martinez. And we're in Bushland territory on their 46-yard line. Number 42, Regalado back there, okay. Three receivers on the right side. Wood's going to run with it. He'll have a few yards this time. Oh, he nearly broke a big one, but he'll pick up about three. Good hustle there, but Bushland to slow that one down to a three-yard pickup. Four-yard, give him four. So it's second and six. We need to take advantage of this break, Bob. We need to go down and get some points out of this. Second down and six to go. 7.25. Clock running, third quarter. Mules up 21-3. Caleb keeps it up the middle and breaks for about eight yards in the first down. To the 34, 32. Thirty-four. Okay, so he picked up eight on that play. Another first down for the Mules. Big first down there as Caleb uh, faked to his running back and then found some room up the middle. Good blocking there by the offensive line. First down and the ball on the 34-yard line now in Bushland territory. 7:09. Mules here running some clock and they have a drive going. They lead 21-3. High snap. Now, Powell, oh, we have a, oh, man, alive. We had a touchdown, Bob. No one around within 40 yards, and we overthrow the receiver. Oh, my goodness. That's awesome. That was Sanchez. Sanchez. It just, he just couldn't catch it, Bob. That's just too high. And we were wide. I mean, wide open. It looked like the uh, snap back to Caleb was a little high and got him off his rhythm somewhat, but he just uh, couldn't get the ball down. So, second and ten. And that was touchdown then, if we catch it. And here they come. This time they came in there and Wood's going to lose yardage. Campbell on the tackle. You could see them coming into the line, Bob. They were about to have a full-fledged stunt in there. and, and uh, We're not well. Uh, they're doing a lot of stunning on us, and we're not picking them up we either. We've had a few big plays, but we lose uh, three yards on that play, so it's third and 13, and the mule's in danger of bogging down another drive. Of course, on first down, uh, we had the play that would score, but we just didn't connect. So third down and 13. Caleb Wood, the quarterback. Ryan Johnson, the center. Good snap back. And he has some time. He fires, and it's behind the receiver and incomplete. Fourth down, we'll probably go for it. And that was Ross. And, Bob, he was open. I mean, he was just open. That's a first down, probably not a touchdown. But to pass behind him, and we did have some time then. We had some time. Caleb's just not uh, been on like he normally is. But uh, let's see what we do on fourth down here. 6.09 remaining. And the Falcons still very much in this game. If they hold us here. Empty backfield. 
But then you would. Okay, Wood back, looks, looks, has a man out there, and it is caught this time, and that's why you don't that's why you don't punt right there, Bob. 81 wide open and Caleb to the 10. All the way down to the 10, 26 yards. That's why you don't punt it, Bob. <laughs> right there. And uh, Caleb's had a little trouble uh, being accurate tonight, but he just took his time and placed that one in there and a good catch. And that was uh, uh, a compass on the catch. All right. All right. There goes Caleb up the middle, picked up one or two, and he's down hard. First down and uh, what? Oh, Ronnie, that was Baron. 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 Baron caught it. Okay, Baron. That's a good catch for Baron. Okay. Okay, Baron. 81 is Baron. He's leaving the ball game now. Uh, so it's going to be second down goal from the nine and a half. We picked up maybe nothing that time. Okay, here we go. Probably throw it in the end zone. We may, if we don't uh, connect here, we may, if we have to, try the field goal here. Wood and trouble, wood and trouble, and there's a flag. A flag for something. Maybe they got a face mask. more field to throw. Okay, we're all the way back to the 23 yard line with a second down and 23 to go now. Goal to go from the 23 now. Is that a 15 yard? Well, that was further than I thought. Well, we were from the. I guess it's, it's probably where the holding took place, yeah. Okay, we have Junior Bach in the backfield. Now they're moving him back up to the 20, yeah. And that's a true 10-yard penalty there, okay. So second and goal from the 20-yard line, second down coming up. And probably a lot of pressure this time on Caleb. We'll see if the mules can hold out Bushland and give Caleb some time and see what happens. And there we go again. That reverse again to number 14, Ross. Ross. We are getting the flags. Must have been a block in the back. Austin Ross has a has a big uh, not a first down, but he's down inside the 10, and we get another flag on us. Yeah, I guess we're just holding. I guess it's holding. Yeah, that's ten more yards. So we're uh, this is two drives down inside the ten that we have uh, messed up here recently. If we don't come out with something on this, and that was a big play there. We we weren't going to score, but oh, we're back down to the thirty now. Back to second down this time and forever. Second and 30 for a touchdown. 5.03, clock running. And the pass is thrown down there, caught for a touchdown. Can you believe that? It is. We just got behind them then. We, we have two penalties on that, Bob. That was Ross. <laughs> Ross made the catch. Ross just made the big run on the end of the round. We have two big penalties on that. <laughs> and from a first and goal from the nine, we end up on the, or ten, well, ten. I, I guess you'd say we move all the way back to the 30, and then we just get behind Bushland and a good catch and a good pass in. Good pass from Caleb, and Caleb had a lot of pressure on him then, too. He put the ball in there and good catch by Ross. All right, and here's a kick. The kick is a bad snap and uh, <laughs> well, we just bad snap then, nothing out of that. We did get the touchdown, so the score jumps up to 27 to three. Muleshoe with 4:49 to go. And Bob, we've uh, you know we've had uh, the Falcons have played very well. We'll give them credit for that, but we've also had some trouble tonight Back getting in sun. That killed some time there. 2.13 remaining third quarter, 27-3 Muleshoe. They have the ball on their own about 39-yard line. Wide receivers out to both sides, slot men. There goes Caleb, and he's going to run for about three or four up the middle. 
maybe five. A little bit of blocking. Yeah, we had, uh, and it looked like uh, they were opening it up a little bit outside then, Bob, and Caleb picked up five. He had 79 on, uh, looks like 15 carries. 79 yards, 15 carries for Caleb Wood. Second down between about four and a half for the first down. Clock running, winding down the final two minutes here in the third quarter. There's a pass, and whoo, that's a tough pass. Didn't make a first down. We Did we not catch it? That was incomplete. Incomplete. That was in a crowd then, Bob. So it's third down and four to go. Ross couldn't hang on to that. And he was hit just as the ball got there. Pretty good pass in, but it was threaded in between two. Yeah, that's right. Two defensive backs. So it's third down here, and the Mules will have to give the ball right back up if they can't convert here. Clock stopped. 139, third quarter. There's Wood. He's going to keep it. There's a pitch, and we're going to make a big one on that, Bob. That may go. That may go. No flags down. And we just went 60 yards for the touchdown. Good Lord, late flags. My goodness. What are they doing? They didn't throw one until we scored. Surely we didn't block back way back behind the Well, I mean, there wasn't anybody around him. I guess we did. That's going to be well, we had a big touchdown run and looked like no flags, and all of a sudden they come raining out of the sky. I don't know. Let's see what they did. Who? Oh, okay. okay, it was a touchdown. That's what I, because we did score then before the flags came out. All right, who who scored the touchdown? Junior Baca goes 60 yards. That should get him over 100, Bob. All right, so, well, the Mule's got the touchdown, and I guess I guess somebody did something they shouldn't have back there. <laughs> 33 to 3, but that was not smart, if that's the case. Oh, that wasn't smart. No, I didn't see what happened, but it had to be yeah. way back Yeah, I mean, it was. Because, I mean, there wasn't anybody was around the runner. Flag. Yeah, yeah. I guess we hit somebody or something. All right, here's a kick. Looks good. It is good. So the Mules get the big run out of Junior Baca. We've had a lot of big plays tonight, and uh, Bushland has stopped us very well much of the night, but then we broke the big one on them, either passing or running, and we lead 34-3 to three with 127. The uh, remaining. Mules lead 34-3, to three and we're just underway here in the fourth quarter. This uh, Taylor Cornelius has a very fine arm. Now we have three receivers over to the right. We have one running back, one receiver to the left. Now Cornelius straight back, throws. It is caught. And he's he's going to be out of out of bounds on about the eight. We hit, we hit out of bounds, Ronnie. And that's going to move it away down there. And that pass was from the tw that pass was from the 21 to the eight. That'll be half the distance to the And it'll be half the distance to the ball. Eight, 13 yards. Yeah, and half the distance. They're going to put it on about the four. Yes, four yard line. Half the distance. First and goal. Got to come away with some with a touchdown here. 11.31 left in the fourth quarter, and they're knocking on the door, and 14 buyers, but he didn't get a whole lot then. Maybe a yard. Give him, give him a yard. Give Byers 14, number 14 a yard. So it's going to be second and goal from about the three and a half. Well, actually, <laughs> four. <laughs> Three. <laughs> he didn't make a whole lot, but. And good defense in there by, let's see who got that, Ronnie. Uh, 51, 51 on the, on the tackle in. Frank Byers again, same one. 
Well, he made about yeah, he made about one, and we'll get to the tackle on that in just a minute. Fifty-one. You, you've got my. Fifty-one made the tackle in. That was I, I thought that's who it was. Uh, Hoxiel Lopez, and the quarterback keeps it. He he kept it and just walked into the end zone from three yards out. The quarterback Taylor Cornelius. So uh, the Mules stopped them twice, but they couldn't stop them that last time, and that's going to make it thirty-four to nine. And uh, they'll probably go for two here, I would think. And there's still a lot of time left. Ten seventeen. Now they're going back to their regular formation. Out of, and the kicker is, is this? Uh, number number eleven is the kicker, and that is J T Torres. And it's good. And that makes the score thirty four to ten in favor of the Mules, and we'll have the kickoff. The Mules will be going in now. It's from the three. So it's fourth, it's fourth down. He got about a yard. Now we're where we started, from the one. But we got fourth instead of fourth down. This is, this is good, tough defense by the Falcons. Well, actually, I guess there's no gain because it's closer to the two. They try to make go wide here. We may try something right wide here, Ronnie, because we've sure had trouble going up the middle on them. Yeah. And it's caught over there for a touchdown. Hey. And let's see who caught that, Ronnie. Okay. Uh, 81 is Barone. Matthew Barone. So, Falcon really made us work for that one, Ronnie, from the one yard line. But it was a touchdown from uh, Caleb Wood to Matthew Barone. And Caleb did get hit then. Ross is holding, Elizalde kicking. And it looks good. Oh, I thought that. I guess it was wide. So it is 40 to 10 with 307 left. Same formation. Three to the right, one to the left, one run back. Hand the ball off to uh, Cannon. Cannon, And good run there by Cannon as he's going to pick up about uh, 11 yards. And a first down. Cannon has a good many yards, Ronnie. 11. 59 yards for Cannon. 21 first downs for the Falcons. And we have just over two minutes. Now he wants to throw the ball, and it's complete. And we'll see who caught that. Smith was a receiver, and he picked up six or seven. Now again, the same formation, three receivers to the right, one to the left. Cornelius in the spread, straight back, throws it, and it is incomplete. It looked like the running back, I mean the receiver, wasn't ready for that one. Third and three. And Ronnie Cornelius has thrown the ball many times tonight. <laughs> we'll have to figure that up, but he's okay. There's a handoff, and I believe it looks like he made the first down. This Cannon's a tough runner. Picked up about uh, four. Four. Made four. So it'll be first and ten from the mule uh, thirty. <laughs> okay, twins to both sides. Gonna, they want to throw a little screen there, and that's uh, that's number eighty-five Petzl again. 
but he uh, he lost some yards in. Lost five. That was 85, and he lost five. Or actually, yeah, five. So it'll be second and 15 for the Falcons. 53 seconds. Yeah, he's going to throw it deep. Oh, my goodness. Looks like that was, it looked like he's out of bounds. Well, maybe. Yeah, but that was, that was quite a throw and quite a, quite a catch, but he was out of bounds. I think when he caught it, he went out of bounds. Third and 15 with 41 seconds left. And it's uh, that was uh, really a good catch, but he was out of bounds. And there we have a flag for something. Could be holding on Bushland the way they're backing up. Hadn't had any indication yet, but. Referees uh, well, discussing it over. <laughs> so we'll have to wait and see what they what they call. <laughs> well, they're marking it off, but I still haven't seen the signal. But it must have been holding. Ten yards, Ronnie, holding. But no. How many we got to go here? Uh, okay, that's that. It should be 25. Second and 25. Oh, right there! Yes. Oh, wide open. And he catches it all the way down inside the 15. So he needed 25, Ronnie, and got about 35, I think, or 30. Well, he went from he went from the 35 to the uh, 12. Yeah, back again. And it's caught for a touchdown. That's 12 yards, Ronnie, with 26 seconds to go. So that was the other. That was the, twelve yards. That was the other Cornelius. That was from Cornelius to Cornelius, and it's forty to sixteen with extra point coming up. I, I feel like they're going to go for two here. Well, maybe not. Yes. Yeah, and they are, they're indicating they're going to kick it. And Torres, number 11, kicked and he kicks it, and it's right down the middle, and it's 40 to 17 with 26 seconds remaining.